Hi again, Doug here from X-Frames FPV, and today i got a build-up video for you. Now this is of the Neato 180, they call this the Sexy Little Beast. And um, this is a really great frame from Neato. It's really durable, I've owned one of these and for a while, and I just really enjoy flying it. It's a really durable frame and quite well laid out. Um, one of the things they did send me, and I'm thankful for them, this is actually not available quite yet, but sent to me to test and this is their gasket this is their antenna gasket and basically how it works you got the top plate here and it sits right under your top plate and gets mounted and what it does is it allows for a little bit of flex and a little bit of give on your antenna when you crash so it's going to save antennas it's going to save vtx's and it's a great option so i'm excited for them to to offer that one of the other things that they've done on, I don't know if they're calling this the version 2 or they're just doing this on all their frames is it does have cutouts in the bottom so if you want to run a bottom mounted and um, lipo as opposed to a top mounted lipo you have that option so they're really doing a great job over there the guys over at Neato. Now secondly here we've got the Maytech 5-in-1 this has a 3 amp 5 volt regulator and a half amp I think it's 500 milliamp let me double check that yeah, 500 milliamp 12 volt regulator and has the option if you want to run a buzzer um, has the option to do that and that's a really great PDB as far as flight controllers well we're running the FPV kebab hyperlight this is a f4 flight controller and just simple really easy layout and works really well now you guys aren't surprised to see this right these are the hyperlight v2s i absolutely love these motors and you see them a lot on a lot of my builds because i just for the money i just i think you can't beat these motors they're 2205 2600 kv on these four inch builds that setup is just super efficient and plenty of power i absolutely love this uh, motor on this frame i've put them on quite a few um, as far as motors while well, we're running the speedix es20s these are BO Heli S and D Shot capable up to D Shot 800 and just a really small, well laid out ESC that works really well. As far as cameras, we're running the Pyro Drone. This is a rebranded Foxier Arrow, and the Arrow is a really great camera with built in OSD and allows you to get OSD right to your goggles, which is a great option. As far as receivers, this is FR Sky XSR, nice and small to get in those small places. Now for VTX, we are running the DYS MI200. This is a great inexpensive option for VTX. It just works. There's, you know, there's nothing, doesn't have any extra special bells and whistles, but it just works and it's a great option we're gonna be running. This will be mounted basically, sorry, um, it will be mounted underneath the top plate and then the antenna out the back. So it's a great option for that. So that's the build of the Neato 180. And I'll get this built up for the customer and he will really enjoy it. So thanks so much, guys. I appreciate you. Check out my website at xframesfpv.com and you can see builds like this and pricing. Or just get a hold of me. My All my contact information is in the description. And we can go over any options that you'd like to go over. So thanks again. I hope you get some time to fly.